Can Louis Vuitton be considered quiet luxury? Hey guys, it's Laura. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about Louis Vuitton and some interesting bags that they are releasing. Now, Louis Vuitton is pretty much synonymous with their monogram. For as long as I can remember, I have seen the Neverfull in the LV monogram, in the Demi Ben, in the Demi Azur. That bag has been everywhere imprinted in my memory ever since I can remember and Louis Vuitton really became famous for this monogram and for their coated canvas and like with everything there's trends so we used to have the logo mania trend everyone wanted logos everywhere now everybody wants quiet luxury I have seen some articles maybe talking about logo mania coming back but for the most part, people are wanting quiet luxury. So can Louis Vuitton do quiet luxury bags? There are some bags that don't have the canvas. They do have leather bags. They have the Capucines bags. But typically, those bags will have hardware with the LV. But Louis Vuitton has released some interesting bags. I don't know if you've noticed them on the website. If you have, let me know. But they've released a couple bags for pre-order that are literally called the Loki. The first one is the Loki Hobo style in the MM size. It comes in three different colors, black, cognac, and limestone. And the only branding that it has is just there at the bottom in the gold foil. And then there's a padlock with LV on it. This hobo bag style is retailing for $3,600. Again, it's pre-order. It is grained calfskin leather. There's a calfskin trim. And the interior is a suede calfskin lining. And it's the gold hardware from Louis Vuitton. Inside, there is a monogram zip pocket that you can remove. So you do get monogram. It does come with a strap. It's not removable, but it is adjustable. And it's interesting to to note that they actually reference quiet luxury in the description of the bag. It says with its minimal lines its superb craftsmanship the low-key hobo mm bag embodies quiet luxury. So they are very cognizant of that trend and I know that we have seen a lot of articles and videos in the past talking about how maybe they're going to get rid of their monogram canvas. Personally, I hope that never happens. But Louis Vuitton the last few years really have been pushing their leather bags. Now, the other low-key style bag that they have is the shoulder bag. This one is also for pre-order. It's $2,950. And it comes in similar colorways, black, cognac, and then the cream color has a different name. It's called quartz. As you can see in the front, you do have that padlock, and it's more prominent than on the hobo bag, which was on the side. It does have the LV logo in the middle. And then on the back, it's just plain leather, so if you did want to turn it around, hide that padlock, you easily could, and then you would never know it was a Louis Vuitton bag from the other side. There is an interior zip pocket, but then the other two compartments are open. You just have the buckle that would go over the top of the bag and secure into that padlock. The interior also seems to be that suede calfskin lining, and I do like when bags have that lining. I think it gives it more of an elevated look and feel. Again, this description also talks about the bag being quiet luxury. It says the low-key shoulder bag bespeaks quiet luxury with its sleek design and expert craftsmanship. So what do you guys think of these quiet luxury bags from Louis Vuitton, the low-key hobo MM and the low-key shoulder bag? Would you consider ordering them? Are they a little too plain for you? Do you just love Louis Vuitton monogram? Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. And if you're not done watching, I'll leave two videos on the screen right now for you to watch. Bye guys.